In this video I'd like to show you how to annotate a graph using Google Documents. So I created a new Google drawing. I'm going to insert the image of my graph which I called motion graph for Google drawing which I had saved on my desktop. Okay I'm now going to make this graph full size that is I'm going to make it the width of my drawing. I now want to label the different regions so I'm going to use shapes, I'm going to use a rectangle and I'm going to highlight my first region which starts at zero and ends around the four second mark. You'll notice that um, my rectangle is opaque so I want to go into custom using the paint bucket use the slider tool for the alpha setting and I can make this thing now semi-transparent okay I now want to add some text so I'm going to make a text box and I want to describe my region so this one is an object at rest I could then bring that in here put it right in the region uh, of my rectangle at the top where I'd like to label it. I can go in here and change the font and the font size make it a little more readable. If I'd like I could change the color. Okay I can also click on both objects then I right click and say align these things horizontally by centers. Okay it looked like they already were so nothing happened. I could then group these things together. Okay, so now they are one object, so when I move them, they move them as a unit. Okay, to do my next one, I can just copy-paste what I've already done, move it over, adjust the size to get to the right spot, go in and change this to acceleration, gaining speed, going forward, Okay, I need to adjust the position of my text. I use my arrow keys to do that. Okay, if I wanted to change the color, I could then go in here to my color setting, change the color, change the transparency, change my alpha setting. Okay, and then do it again for my last region. Once I'm entirely done, I may want to add a title. I may want to center it. Again, I could change the font, change the size, change the color if I so desire, change anything I'd like to make this thing look nicer. Okay, and then when I'm totally done, I go in, change the title. And then share it with my teacher or whoever else I need to share it with. 